as a female entrepreneur in the food and beverage sector, it makes me feel very proud to fill up the shoes of my grandmother here in Tawlat Faiza. My passion for food started when I was little. And I always loved watching my grandmother cook. She is known for creating the best meals that she shares with everyone she loves. There's always a place for you on her table. Tawlat Faiza is named after her. She was born and raised here in Lula. It's just a magical place. The abundance of farms, the fertile soil, makes it so much easier to have a variety of produce to use in the restaurant. Historically, Al-Ula's location on the ancient road means that it's a meeting point for people, for ideas, for exchange of flavor, of culture, of food. And modern al is no different. You can feel that it's special. هنا في العلا يعني أحس إن لأن المزارع هنا يعني إحنا قاعدين ورانا مزارع يعني طعم الخضار والفواكه غير زي عندك البصل الأخضر في فرق لما تشتريه في فرق لما أنت بنفسك تشيلين المزارع صح حتى تحسي طعمه وريحة وريحة الظل ثابت صح فشيء مرة حلو صراحة I think that people are more conscious now about what they're eating and the idea of sustainability. And we wanted to bring that into Tawlat Faiza. We change the menu weekly based on what's fresh in the market and what's fresh in the farms. I find this sustainable, homegrown way of cooking very interesting and inspiring. I want to bring in this ethos to the modern day of Lerda. The first day we opened Tawlat Faiza was very emotional to me. I couldn't hold my tears back. It was the idea of honoring my grandmother this way, going back to her roots, that was very empowering. It really feels like these people are visiting my home, enjoying the food that I cooked for them. It's a place that everyone is welcome at and it's so special for me. It really warms my heart and makes my day. I believe that Lola is becoming the food's destination to visit.